Hello everybody, this is Emma Erze. Today I want to make a small tutorial video for you how to make your own forge. Maybe we want to make a small contest who can create the best spring forge. If the best forge, the winner forge will be good enough, it might make it into the game and of course the winner will be rewarded. Okay, I opened the original forge in the editor. We will provide the original forge file for you. So you can just uh, open it in your editor, file open, and then it will load into the editor. You can, um, with this O tool, you can select things and selected things you can remove with delete button you can also delete uh, objects if you think uh, you will not need them in your spring forge here yeah, i will just remove some stuff you can also have a look into my um, map editor tutorial video that I make previously because I will not uh, explain all the basic movement and stuff here in this video. Okay, to make your own forge you have to change the textures. So you go to Windows Texture Tool and then you can start replacing textures. If you want um, stay similar to the original layout it can be a good idea to just replace some textures but it's also possible that you just remove all the textures and draw them new by yourself as you like it's also possible i first show you how to to uh, replace textures for example i will replace sand dunkel sand dark and if you open the texture tool it will first open like this it will look like this and then you have to press this small arrow and then it will open up okay then the texture you want to replace is selected so i choose greenland and for example this dark green grass so and he will already replace it I can choose for example sand choose another grass and this I can do with everything I want not everything has to be replaced because this uh, twilight bandits and stonekin stuff can maybe stay the same so you have to try out what actually are the textures most written lengths what is it ah, okay it's here some stuff okay so you can figure out what it is and how you want to change it it's also possible that you delete um, textures completely for example here sand dark i can also with right click erase erase the texture completely here you have color this is just the basic color that you can choose and you have a blending this is for the edges then you have normal this is kind of the structure of the texture here you can try around a lot yeah it's more like stony stuff this doesn't fit to grass so you have to find something that fits to what you want then you have specular here you can see it's just a little bit changing you have to try also possible that you add completely new textures to the layer set just press new new texture layer and then you do the same you choose which texture you want 
um, to use and then you can draw. These red points, if they appear, it's kind of a, a bug. If too many textures are over each other, then these red dots will appear. So if you have this, then you have to delete some of the textures laying underneath. You call, can also enable debug layers under cursor and then in the left corner it will show you the names of all the textures that are under your cursor. This might be useful. And then you can also um, decorate with some objects. You can use Windows Entity Placement and then you go to Objects and then you can just try around Greenland mm, let me see bushes here we have some flowers if we want some uh, spring spring feeling of course flowers very nice you can also further edit the objects you can choose one object and with a right right click hold and move the mouse you can move it around with mouse wheel press down and move the mouse you can turn it and then you can also for example scale use scaling to make it bigger or smaller and you can tilt it into every direction here with rotation and here are a lot of uh, objects you can use and place. If your map is done, you press uh, save as and then you pray, uh, save your map as you like. Maybe participating on the Springforge competition is also a good way to get the footstep into map making. And we hope uh, we have some participants and some awesome spring forges that we can use in game sometime. So good luck, have fun, kind regards, bye bye.